When we first started planning our whole vineyard and have a winery here, it was really the vision to be somewhat private, as it really has become a sharing experience for us. Not only sharing the land, but, but sharing the wine and wineries and our guest houses, uh, vacation homes. To be able to provide donations to charities where they can come out and, and have a, a picnic lunch, a taste through our wines and then get a tour of the facility. Sustainability and the environment has really captivated me. It led to certainly putting on uh, the first solar panels in Northwest in a winery and then creating the first Gold LEED certified building uh, of a winery structure in the United States. Harvest is my favorite time of year. People are working really hard. It's just this charge that you get and every year seems to have that same energy to it when the grapes come in and you have know, the October it's cold you're picking you're making all these decisions fermentations going on and it's just a sense of like a new creation solar style we're going for elegance elegant yet powerful wine so the grapes that our site grows we lend to a very fruit forward wine we have our early ripening site. We've got Jory soil, that's that red volcanic well-draining soil, and our site is a moderate elevation between 200 and 650 feet. The site produces this wine that has really beautiful tannins that can be very fine-grained, moderate acidity, and some earthiness. Those components come through every vintage, whether it's a cool vintage or a hot one. I really just want to accentuate those ingredients in the glass based on the vintage. And so winemaking stylistically will change year to year based on what I get in, but the vision is to make this ageable, elegant, yet powerful wine. We always have in our mind the style of which wine we're trying to create. So we come to the table knowing we're making ultimately two main blends. The JV is intended to be consumed at an earlier age, very approachable and a set style. And so is the SV being a celebrable, ageable, elegant, complex Pinot Noir. So we take those visions to the table when we're blending and we work with the pieces that we're given to create those two different blends. You have to enjoy people, you have to like people, and I learned very early on that working with people is what I really enjoy doing. I do envision that the, the property will be in our family for centuries to come in the future. What I like for everyone to take from Stoller is the warm and genuine hospitality that we offer. What I'd like everyone to know is that we're all about fun too. So along with the wines come great fun, disc golf, picnics, patio settings, and all of the events. Sometimes the events are only for our club members, so we encourage everyone to join. One of the warm and family related feelings that you get uh, as a club member, you feel that this facility, this incredible winery, and the wines are your uh, family. Stoller has grown a lot but we've never lost sight of wanting to be a family for not only ourselves, but also for our guests.